Hey, what's up? Welcome back. Um, today's video is a swatch video slash first impressions because that's what I used on my eyes today. So I'll let you know how that worked for me. I didn't film a tutorial on it because, I mean, this is not everybody's cup of tea. But this is the look I came up with. I came up with and it is using the Urban Decay New Collection with um, John Michelle Basquiat. I hope I didn't kill the name. Um, so, this is a new collection from Urban Decay. I just came back from Sephora not too long ago, like an hour ago, and I mean, I had to make a swatch video because these palettes are amazing. So, my Sephora only had the three palettes and an eyeliner so that's like what i grabbed so they didn't have the other two and there's still two eyeliners and three lipsticks but they didn't have any of that and yeah so the palettes do retail for 39 dollars and this one i believe is 35 this is the blush palette and this is for 35 dollars and this is all i have on my face today uh so yes Jean Michel, um, he was a graffiti artist back in the 80s. He died back in 1988. He was like 27, 28 years old when he died. But yeah, he was pretty famous. He was a pretty famous artist. So yeah, like I said, they did come up with a collection, which is, uh, like I said, blush palette, two eyeshadow palettes, two eyeline three eyeliners. Um and three lipsticks so yeah so like i said i only have the two palettes the blush palette and an eyeliner and this is what i have on my eyes today on my cheeks and yeah but like i said i didn't record a tutorial because i get it not everybody's gonna like this colorful look but if you guys do want a tutorial let me know and i'll be happy to record it i mean i really like it <laughs> But you guys know I love color. So yeah. Um, so let's get into it. So I'm going to start with the eyeshadow palettes. It's, it's like a canvas. You can totally like put it up on your wall. Here it is. And then it has like the little crown. It's like a signature thing. And this one is a colorful one. This is the one I used on my eyes today. It does come with a little brush. Double ended brush. And those are the colors. There are eight eyeshadows and they're beautiful. And yeah, so let's swatch them. So we're gonna go with Studio 1960, which was his, the year he was born. Neo and LES. So those are the first. The four first swatches and I'm gonna go to graffiti exu boom and untitled wow so those are the eight swatches of the colorful palette I do have these two the pink and the purple and as my transition shapes because the purple I, I try to work with the purple but the purple is not not as pigmented as the other shades and then I have this lime green on my lid if you can tell and then this blue like to darken my whole crease and all that good stuff so we go to the neutral palette this one right here and this one's so cool it opens okay it comes with the brush guys <laughs> and that's the palette right there i don't want to blind you guys so this is more of your neutral palette everyday palette so let's start with enigma levitation not for sale and sucker punch just drew my hand this one barely shows on my skin. Okay, so those are the four, first four shapes. Okay, 
next we got our influence bk pseudonym i don't know i'll write it somewhere in here and crown So those are the, that's the other neutral palette or more neutral palette because it does have like a navy blue. This one I didn't use so I only, like I said, I only use the colorful one because the colorful one was colored to me. Those colors are beautiful. So yeah. Next is the blush palette. This is retail for $34 or $35. I'll link that down below. They're not for sale like on the like on Sephora.com, Ulta.com, or uh, Urban Decay.com. They're coming, they're gonna be released on April 20th. But I went to my Sephora and asked that they had it, and they did, and they sold it to me. So you can do that. Yay! Okay, so let's start with X rated. Beautiful pink blush. Jawbone. I guess a lot of people can use this one as as a bronzer. Noho. And the highlighter, now's the time. Which is the highlighter I have on my cheeks. And these are supposed to be the uh, the other ones, the formula of their other blushes, of their uh, permanent line of blushes. It's supposed to last, look at that highlighter, up to eight hours. So that's pretty cool. I have only had it for like maybe 20 minutes and it's still on. So like I said, that's the blush palette. It's freaking beautiful. Love it. And lastly, like I said, they only have, they had one eyeliner. It's what I have on my waterline. It's so freaking soft. It's like their other eyeliners. They are so soft. Um, they're gone. They glide like butter, which is really good. So that's all I got of this collection. I do want the rest of the collection. I think I'm going to get the bolt, the bolt. Which, okay, these by themselves, this one's like I said, 39, the other one 39, this one's 35, these ones are, I want to say 17, between 17 and 20. Um, I think they're 20, I think. So there's going to be two more, so that's, what, $60 and three, the, the lipsticks are 17 each, and there's going to be three, but if you buy the bolt, it's like 165 and if you buy everything separately, it's going to come around 200 and so if you, okay, if you buy the bolt, it's 165 and if you buy them separately, it's going to come out to about 200 and 200, $224. So by buying the bolt, you're going to save but buying the bolt you'd save around $60 rounding it it's like around $60 so I mean it's a better deal to get the bolt I would totally wait for that and that's what I'm gonna get too I'm gonna get the bolt too because I mean it has everything and the packaging looks so cute so yeah so that's my little swatch oh hold on hold on so these like I said I did use a colorful palette today Honestly, um, all these shades performed really good. Um, Exu, I did use my uh, Max Fix Plus, so because honestly, it wasn't showing up that good on my eyes, on my eyelid. But oh my god, Untitled, this color right here is so freaking pigmented like, no joke, guys. That was just, I barely touched the shadow. It's so freaking pigmented, it's so beautiful. And then Neo right there, the purple one, it's not a good shade. It's really patchy. And look. See? We can hardly see it. So I wasn't impressed with that one. Um so that's why I added untitled on top. Because I was gonna darken the whole look with Neo, but that had no pigmentation whatsoever. 
but untitled had i think it has his its pigment it has its pigmentation plus neo's pigmentation because it's freaking amazing so yeah 1960 is a pretty light color it's what i use on my transition but yeah the rest like for exo like i said i did have to use mac fix plus to make it show up on the eyes as you can tell i have that colorful vibe today so yeah but um i mean in all like i really like this palette i love colorful looks and yeah so i really like it the eyeliner like i said super soft it went on like butter i do recommend this palette if you like colorful looks or if you're like a collector totally yeah um but if you are more into neutral looks then get the neutral palette but i totally like 100 percent recommend the blush palette because you get your highlighter you get three blushes or if you're light enough you get a, even a bronzer a bronzer and two blushes so it's totally worth it I do recommend it. I hope you guys liked this video. If you guys did, please give this video a big thumbs up. If you haven't done so, please subscribe. And if you have, thank you so much. And I'll see you guys in my next video. <laughs> Bye.